guys, it's Tuesday the 19th of July today and we are back from our holiday as you can see. Will is at the gym right now and we sort of made this deal that when we got back from Mallorca we would both like sort out our diet and stop eating so unhealthy and try and be better and all that but I just really fancy a McDonald's breakfast today and last night I was a bit upset about some stuff so I'm just gonna treat myself, you know. Little Archie is waiting for me. Hey, are you ready to go? Are you ready to go to McDonald's? And then we're gonna go and see the bunnies and we're gonna get mommy's laptop, yeah. Sit. Archie, sit. <laughs> sit. Sit. Want to. Archie, you have to sit. He doesn't wanna get his butt sit. wet. Sit down. Sit. But there's another dog here. What are you growling at? What are you barking at? What's up? You just don't even care, do you? I can't smell it because it's not open. Yeah. A few weeks ago, a company on Twitter asked us if we would like to review one of their boxes. And um, because Archie's a puppy, they sent us a puppy box. And if I can close the box, which apparently I can't. Oh, come on. Archie, blimey. It's the Barney's Biscuit Boxes. They're really cool. They have dogs and bones on. And they come with all of this stuff in it, which I know Archie is going to want to play with later. But in the box, we got an entire tub of Pooch and Mutt Puppy Development Treats, which, see, look. <laughs> Pooch and Mutt Puppy Development Treats, which Archie absolutely loves. Betty Miller's Oven Baked Natural Treats Puppy Dog. And these are, oh, they're free from wheat, free from gluten. I'm not sure what flavor they are, but if they're for puppies, I'm assuming it's probably like a chicken type flavor. I'm probably just being really blind, but I can't see it. But anyway, those look cute. The Brambles Puppy Treats Milkies for your new best friend. Oh, I think these are by Barking Heads. I like Barking Heads. Um, oh, look, they're cute. For gentle digestion, wheat-free, with chicken and salmon, strong teeth and bones, handmade with love. And I like Barking Heads because, I don't know if you can see it here, but they fight against puppy farming, which is exciting. It's a complimentary pet food for puppies aged 16 weeks and over. So you can have some of these, Archie. Cool, cool. And then finally we have the natural way, all natural ingredients, puppy. So I'm not sure. Yeah, again, it's a complimentary food, so it's a treat really. And it has fresh carrot, yogurt, eggshell, sunflower kernel, flaxseed and parsley. So we'll try some of these as well, won't we, Arch? But at the moment, you just want to eat the paper that came in the box. Okay. 
So yes, um, every box that is sold, some of the money goes towards um, dog rescue and animal adoption and promoting rescue dogs and everything. So it's a really lovely cause um, and I just wanted to feature them in the vlog quickly because we're going to be photographing this today to write a blog post and I'm sure the blog post will go up before this video so I'll make sure that I link it in the description. It will be on Archie's blog, won't it? What are you doing? I don't know if I've shown you yet, but Archie can do rollover now and he's probably going to completely ignore me now that I've tried to get it on camera, but anyway. Archie down. <laughs> See? Down. Roll over. Good boy. <laughs> Sorry, I had to catch that quickly, so I'm not sure if you even saw it, but he does roll over now. You're quite clever, aren't you, really? You just don't want to listen most of the time. Everyone, it's Saturday evening and... I haven't really filmed today or this week at all, um, but we haven't done much today. We took Archie to puppy hour this morning. We've been persevering with it and it was much more positive this week. He was much happier. He made quite a few little friends and was much more comfortable. So he obviously is getting better with it. Um, yeah, now we're gonna take Archie for a walk because he's getting a little bit crazy and we're going to uh, catch some Pokemon. That's what everyone's doing now. Hi guys, it's Sunday today and it's just Archie and I again. Uh, this time Will has gone to his parents' house can't remember what they were doing, maybe putting up fence panels or something today? I can't remember, but he said he would help his dad because his dad has helped us with stuff at our house. So that's where he is today. And I could have gone with him, but I didn't want to leave Archie here. Normally we take Archie to his parents' house if we go there, but because they're going to be working in the garden and Archie's only allowed in the garden at their house, I didn't want us to get in the way and I didn't want them to get annoyed at Archie because he's going to want to play and he's going to want to see them. That's what puppies do. So I thought we would stay home but it ended up being super boring. It's now half one. Um, I've tidied around the house a little bit. I've um, filmed a couple of YouTube videos and I've just got ready, <laughs> had lunch, got ready. And now I'm going to take Archie over to my parents' house I think. For the last few days, his ears have flopped back down. <laughs> he, like, for ages, he, his ears were down when he was really tiny. And then um, his left ear popped up and his right one stayed down. And now for the last two days, they've both been back down again. So, not sure what that's about. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just getting my bag ready. I need to pop his harness on for the car. And then, um, yeah, we're going to go to my parents' house and see if anyone's there. My dad have been at the caravan. Um, we have a caravan in Hailing Island. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you'll know all about it. Um, my parents have been at the caravan for a few days. So I don't know if they're actually going to be home. I doubt they will be. My brothers might be there, but again, they might be off Pokemon hunting. And my brother, like my eldest younger brother, will probably be with his girlfriend. But we're going to go over there and have a look anyway. I've got a magnetic curtain to put on the magnetic fly curtain to put on the bunny shed. So I'm going to do that anyway. And if there's no one there, then maybe we'll just play with Ruby for a bit and then go on to somewhere else because I'm really tired of sitting at home all day. <laughs> Is that your bed, Archie? Have you claimed it? I think it's actually Ruby's. Oh, has he stolen your bed? Get off, Rubes. You're going to tear my top. <laughs> These two play so nicely together. <laughs>
Right, so I was right when I said there would be no one here, there isn't anyone here. I thought I'd hang around for a little while just so that Ruby and Archie can play together because as you can see, they like to play together. And um, I thought I would hang around and see if either of my brothers came back, but I'm not sure they're going to. Um, so yeah, I'm by myself, but I did put up my magnetic fly net thing for the rabbit shed and it, it I think it's going to do the job. It was a bit of a mission to put up because it's quite difficult in a shed rather than like a proper doorway, but I think it's going to do the job for the rest of the summer. So definitely £5 well spent there. Now I'm just going to let these two play for a bit, although Archie came up here to go to sleep and now he's tormenting her from the edge of the couch. And he's covered in straw and hay because he went to see the ducks too. What are you two doing? <laughs> 